Well, we got aloe vera because my nephew decided to have a nice treatment on his face. This is a um, $6 plant and he also bought um, a little pot. Um, looks nice together. Mm. Remember one thing. When you are just pouring water, do not pour water directly on the plant because it's going to be gone within a week. Just remember to put the water in this container and then go back with aloe vera. And honestly, the plant was six bucks. It was like $12 for the container that I thought was fancy. Come on, that's great for the, a lifetime of skincare products with aloe vera. We are going to prepare a simple remedy for the eyes you cut aloe vera this is it cut a little bit like that you see this yummy stuff coming out this one you have to let it go as long as if it's yellowish the rest of the stuff is good the next thing you are cleaning the leaf because it has a lot of dust on that cutting off the edges delicately And then the other edge. Here you go. Then the stuff which is inside, you are cutting the skin nicely and slowly, making sure that it's the most important part stays inside of the leaves. That's what you are having, this part. You take the knife, not the sharp one, but the other one and you are removing this white stuff once you are done you are just cutting that a little bit and you put that to the fridge overnight so in the morning you are taking that out of the fridge putting under your eyes and leave for 10 minutes the stuff which is left over you are just massaging your eyes around for 10 another 10 minutes and that what is supposed to help with your black spots under your eyes and again the other one then this side Good. And we are cutting off this skin. All right. And again, with the knife, which is not sharp, the other one, you are just moving that nicely out. Making it to little pieces. And then I have a very small bowl like that, putting those pieces into that and leaving in the fridge, making sure that it's not going to dry. You can cover with something, could be foil, and you are just putting those pieces in the morning and massaging whatever is left over. Here you go. I hope you really enjoyed this video. I remember to leave some comments under and remember to subscribe. And the reason why my aunt Ella from, uh, you know, Ella's Garden and Kitchen is, is helping me with the bags under my eyes that I do a lot of social media videos and I asked her, what can I do for the bags under my eyes that I see? Occasionally it's dehydration and she showed me this amazing recipe. So we're gonna find out does it improve it instead of going to like specific getting surgery done or non-invasive uh, processes that cost hundreds to thousands of dollars? Let's see what happens. Take a look, everyone. This is before. Thanks, Ella. You're welcome.